Well, I think it's incredible that you've had this experience of being with someone as iconic as Prince, as well as all the other incredible artists that you've mentioned. Um, yeah, I know you. Prince had a kind of rumored odd personality, you know, sometimes asking people to read his mind for instruction. But I'm really happy to hear that he taught you things about how to be a better musician, how to be a better oh, yeah. band player. You know, mm -hmm. I think that's cool. Very cool. He didn't give me the step by step, but if I was, if I was watching and listening, which is what I'm still going to encourage your young people who are listening, watch and listen. Look at what your the people have done before you. Look at how they did it, and then improve on it. Right? Prince taught me more in the three years I was there than I could have ever learned by myself or in a college. I'm telling you, it was incredible. And you have to be willing to learn. You yes. have to be teachable. You can't be so so, you know, boneheaded that you think you know it all. And that's that that is a problem when you're seventeen, eighteen. I went into that going, I'm pretty damn cool. <laughs> and I went, oh, I don't know anything. This guy knows everything. So let me just be a sponge. Be be vulnerable vulnerable enough to be teachable, yes. and then make it better. Yes, and humble enough to allow for instruction. I mean, there's no question, because you have children. I have a, mm -hmm. ch a child. I mean, he's not a little child anymore. He's an adult. But yeah. that impatience that goes along with what you were saying earlier about people that are on TikTok, where yeah. you only get, you know, like a very limited amount of time to try to get someone's attention before they move on to something else. Mm-hmm. That's a reflection of the way people's mentality is, especially young people, that impatience. I want to be satisfied yeah. now. There are certain things that you're not going to get the satisfaction from right away. You know, I mean, I've talked to many musicians who've said they played over and over. You can hear Niall talking about how he didn't know how to tune a guitar and he was playing and going like, why isn't this working? And then once he figured uh -huh. out, oh, if I tune it, then it's going to sound like the Beatles song I'm trying to play and then right. get better. Yep. There are steps. There is a, there is a method to the madness. Yes. But you know part of the method could is 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 TikTok. Grow on that. Expand on that. It doesn't have to be only that. Do that, but also keep learning, keep giving, keep creating, keep learning, keep listening. That's what you got to do. And keep being teachable and and uh, expand your horizons and take some risks there's no there, i mean if you want to be an artist take some risk don't play it safe and Amen. don't take any shit from anybody <laughs> be be you be teachable but also be be confident enough not cocky but confident enough to know who you are and that's maybe the hardest lesson to ever learn is who am i Yes. Don't let anybody tell you who you are. You got to know who you are yourself. That is the best advice in the world. I know, thank right? Thank you, Paul. The hardest one. Yes, Lorelai, thank you. So good to see you. You too. Stay out of sight. When we come together, we're going to be all right.